And Luke Hines joins us again. And this morning, we've got something new. What do you call it? Broccoli flour. I know. No. Look, it's a bit of a combination well, of two ingredients. We yes. have broccoli and yes. cauliflower. Yes. Turning it into rice, and what we ended up with is broccoli flour rice. You've okay, heard of good. Brad and Ange. Yes. When all those celebrity couples get together, this is the celebrity couple of vegetables. Right. Well, you used to be a she you used to be a chef for Angelina Jolie, didn't you? I did work with her. It was incredible. Pressure was on then. Yeah. Whereas, you know, it's funny when I saw that policeman dancing. Actually, I had to double take. I thought it was you for a minute. Yeah, I can't dance like that. Uh -oh. I can't dance like that. <laughs> We've I reckon got some other men that can dance like that in the studio today too. That is exactly <laughs> right. Maybe they'll be putting us through our paces. Uh, <laughs> well, I'll keep my clothes on. You, however, can probably take yours off. Okay. Um, but what are we using? <laughs> we're using rangatake chicken, corn-fed, free-range, beautiful chicken, and we're going to be mixing it up with some spices. And what is that? That is coconut cream. We are going to be showing you how to make butter chicken without any butter in sight. We are back in the cafe kitchen. Geez, there's a lot of buff men on the show today. Look at this guy. Uh, but that's because you live clean, you eat healthy, and you're sharing all those recipes with us. Healthy Made Easy is the book. And today we're doing a healthy version of butter chicken. We're using Ringa Tikka Chicken, corn fed free range. It's going to taste even better, but I'm sure when you put your little, little twist on it, it's going to be delicious. Oh, thanks, Mike. Now, look, this is my third day here yep. uh, as your resident cook. And I've got to say, I'm getting used to what type of dishes you like. And I hear you like it hot in the kitchen. Oh, yeah. So we've got some fresh chilli, which we're going to add to this. Now, nice. when it comes to cooking, I love people thinking outside their comfort zones. Right. Which is why today I wanted to showcase a butter chicken. Now, the butter chicken actually doesn't have any butter in it. Great. We're going to showcase how you can do a really healthy version using coconut cream and an abundance of vegetables as well. So That's what, what we love, now, Luke. That's what we love. I'm chopping up a fresh chilli. Yes. Now, apart from the fresh chilli, which I'm going to put through this, there's a number of spices, dry spices, that actually make the butter chicken have the flavour that we all know and love. So I'll chuck that chilli in there. Okay. And your job is to stir that around beautifully, like you do so well. Now, what Fantastic. else is in here? We've got onion, obviously, and a bit of garlic. Onion and garlic. Right. I mean, with all cooking, onion and garlic is the perfect base for most sauces and most curries. It's where it, it's where it brings out most of the flavour. And being a healthy cooker, what oil are you using here? Is that coconut oil? We're using coconut oil today. Oh, yeah. It brings a really beautiful flavour to this, to this nice. Thai-inspired dish. So, what we're going to do now is we're going to add turmeric. Right. Now, look at the colour that we get when you start to stir that turmeric down. That's going to be a butter chicken that colour, That beautiful yeah. butter chicken colour. We've got garam masala in there. We've got ground cumin. Mm -hmm. We've got ground coriander. Right. And because you like it extra hot in the kitchen... Yes. <laughs> ..we have got some chilli powder right there. Geez, you, your cutting on your chilli was a bit rubbish, to be honest, Luke. Oh, come on. <laughs> My goodness. Now, are you noticing the mixture is starting to dry up a little bit? Yes. So we had plenty of moisture in there. Yeah. But what we need to do is add some fresh vegetables to try and get that to soften up right. so that we can cook our curry paste off. So what I'm going to start with is actually just some capsicum yep. and tomato. Now they're going to release their natural juices yes. and what we're going to be left with is a beautiful aromatic butter chicken style curry. Now add these in there and these are going to break down so I can, I can see that they're quite chunky now. But I tell you what, they are going to break down and you are going to love how moist and delicious this butter chicken actually is. So this is a great example of the types of food that people love, that they really love to eat, but then they worry sometimes that, you know, too much of butter chicken is not good for you. So you do a healthy version and you can feel better about your life. That's exactly right. There's a lot of people who have food intolerances these yes. days, and dairy is one of them. Now, butter is a form of dairy, so for those people who can't celebrate those ingredients, this is a fantastic option. Brilliant. How's well, that chilli? It smells so good. You love it? Yeah, I've broken up the bits of chilli that you didn't cut properly. All right, so Got what I'm going <laughs> <laughs> to do now is I'm going to continue adding this so that we get a beautiful curry sauce. And then when we come back, I'm going to showcase how you can make the healthiest rice you'll ever eat. Plus, I think it's way more delicious than the traditional type. Nice. Really looking forward to that. Thank you so much. If you want the recipe, go to thecafe.co.nz. And something else you should do, thank you for all the posts on Instagram you've been putting while you've been joining us here on The Cafe. Thank you. Watch your Instagram handle for people at home to find you. At Luke Hines Online. Check out for lots of recipes and uh, healthy tips. Nice work. And this is my goal, because it is that time of the year, Luke, where we've got to get ready for 
summer. I'm going to use your food, going to get nice and healthy, do some exercise, and have bodies like those boys. Mate, watch out. Yeah, I that's think right. New Zealand better be careful, because already you're a bit of a threat, so <laughs> we've got to watch out. Now, what we've got so far is tomato, capsicum, onion, garlic, an abundance of spices in here mm. to make a really delicious butter chicken. It smells incredible, Absolutely by the way. perfect. Right. Indian cooking at home, made easy. Yeah. Now, this is the fun part. We chuck the chicken in. Right. And get you to get some colour on the nice. outside. So what we're looking for is to brown that chicken. Okay. All right. So basically, browning that chicken seals the flavour inside as we cook it through nice and slowly with the coconut cream. So if we get a little bit more colour on those edges, yep. we're going to be able to pour this beauty in. But first, I want to show you how to make broly flour rice. Yeah, this all is right? all the rage at the moment, isn't it? Definitely, definitely. I love it. I love it. I've never had your combination of broccoli and cauliflower together, but I know that the health benefits of using this type of rice is so good. So how yeah. do you do it, Luke? All right, well, first off, the reason I use cauliflower and broccoli is because they're cruciferous vegetables mm -hmm. and they're really good, packed with fibre and also colour. All right, so when you've got green vegetables like that, you know they're going to be really high in antioxidants, nice. which is why people are having green smoothies and, yep. and all that biz. So what we want to do is we'll get that cauliflower and broccoli in the food processor. Now, guys, you don't need fancy equipment at home to do this. You can actually just chop it by hand. Right. You don't have to do this. This is a little bit of television magic right. so that we can get it happening a little bit quicker. But I will warn you, you want to make rice, you don't want to make cauliflower and broccoli dust which means you have to be mindful how often you blend it for. So I'm going to pulse it. Yes. All right. Don't mind me. Are you all right? Yeah, I'm good. You know, <laughs> what's going on? You know what I'm like with technology. Get it on properly. All right. Now we're talking. Are you ready for some action? Oh, I hope. There you oh, go. hello. OK. <laughs> now, have you ever heard that noise before? Yes. Now, that's what I love about live television here, ladies and gentlemen, in that... We may not be making cauliflower and broccoli rice, and that's the cliffhanger of TV. <laughs> like, you don't know who's going to get a rose. You don't know who's going to be voted off the island. That's right. You don't know if you're going to get cauliflower and broccoli rice. So what we're going to do, before I get evicted from the show, <laughs> is we're going to try it one more time, and if not, we're going to go to a break and we'll find out how to actually solve this you... technology. You know what? I can turn the, the TV on, but that's probably as far right. as it goes. <laughs> Right. I, just, I just love watching you struggle. I'm not really much. What? I'm not really No, we're not, doing it. We're, no, not no, doing it. we're not doing it. We're chicken so, over the chicken. How's that gonna, browning? <laughs> we're going to pour in the coconut cream. Yep. Have a look at that. Nice. Oh, we don't even... We just pretend the cauliflower and broccoli rice didn't ever exist. Right, well, that's we can sort that out. There we go. Break, okay? So you're going to stir that through. Oh, hello. Yes. It's all stir it through. Today. <gasps> so stir that colours. through. Here we go. And look at that colour yeah. transition. It is looking absolutely perfection My right goodness. there. Now, as we slow cook that down, we are going to be able to get a beautiful, rich butter chicken colour coming out of that. We're going to pair it up with the rice, and I think you guys at home are going to absolutely love it. And the good thing is we get to taste test it today, so you can tell me what you actually think. No, no, we'll do that. And I'll tell you what, when we, um, when we leave the kitchen, we'll go and sort this rice out. And you can see it a little later on. You can walk us through that process. Yeah, yeah, it's really Clearly easy. you were going really, to really just easy. fry it up, weren't you? Yeah, that's so it. You know, fry it up and, you know. Nice. OK, cool. We'll come back very soon. Right now, though, let's see what Holly's up to. Thank you, guys. So all we did is we sauteed down the cauliflower and broccoli, and it is looking perfect. Now we're ready to plate up this delicious butter chicken, which I hope you guys oh, oh, oh. absolutely love today. The sauce is rich, the sauce is spicy, and I tell you what, it is going to blow your socks off. We'll get some Oh yeah, good man. There okay. you go. Yeah.